What's up everybody, welcome to Hip Hop Biographics and on this channel we cover hip hop legends, figures and forgotten moments in hip hop. Today we'll be discussing Lil Baby. Dominique Armani Jones, better known as Lil Baby, was born on December 3rd, 1994 in Atlanta, Georgia. Lil Baby grew up in the Zone 4 neighborhood known as Oakland City in the Swats area of Atlanta. Lil Baby didn't struggle academically while in school, but instead, he struggled with staying out of trouble. After constantly being suspended from school, Lil Baby decided to one day stop going. The troubled lifestyle would continue to follow Lil Baby into 2012. In 2012, Lil Baby was 17 when he was arrested for possession with intent to distribute. By facing trial, Lil Baby's lawyer pleaded with him to take a two-year plea deal, but instead, Lil Baby refused and fired his lawyer and obtained another one. Lil Baby's new lawyer would be able to get him placed in a special zero-tolerance program where he was supposed to do only a year, but after a few weeks in, Lil Baby would get in a fight with a racist inmate, which resulted in him being given a two-year prison sentence. In 2014, Lil Baby was arrested again for possession of marijuana with intent to distribute. Lil Baby was released in 2017. After getting out of jail this last time, Lil Baby decided enough was enough and changed his direction of his focus on music. At first, Lil Baby was interested in becoming a rapper. Lil Baby future label head, Coach K, was going to ask him, why doesn't he start rapping since he has the demeanor of a rapper? In which Lil Baby said back to him, I'm a street nigga. Lil Baby would get together with the already famous rapper, Young Thug and Gunna, to get him to show him how to rap. After realizing he had a natural talent for rapping, Lil Baby would go on to release his first project in April of that year called Perfect Timing. Perfect Timing featured guest appearances from artists such as Gunna, Lil Yachty, and Young Thug. After the release of Perfect Timing, Lil Baby garnered a lot of success and attention quickly, which Lil Baby responded by releasing more music, which included his breakout single, My Dog. My Dog peaked at 71 on the Billboard 100, but in the streets, the song was number one. In May of 2018, Lil Baby released his debut studio album, Harder Than Ever, which featured guest appearances from Lil Uzi, Drake, and Offset from Amigos. With the album peaking at number three on the Billboard 200, later that year in October, Lil Baby released a collaborative tape with label mate Gunna, which reached number four on the Billboard 200. Now with two albums in one year reaching the top ten, Lil Baby was seeing superstar success after only being out of prison for one year. Lil Baby was going to release his second studio album in 2020 called My Turn. My Turn flew to the top of the charts reaching number one on the Billboard 200 with featuring songs such as Something to Prove, Emotionally Scarred. Now, in 2021, Lil Baby is at the top of his career and doesn't show any signs of slowing down anytime soon. Now, I hope everybody enjoyed this video today. And if you would, please leave a like and subscribe. And I'll catch you on the next one.